Good afternoon guys, welcome back to George Tasty Kitchen. Today we're gonna make I'm gonna make some pumpkin rice with corn base corn beef with mixed vegetable. And um here are some of the the ingredients that I'm gonna have today. Um as you can see the rice everything is here and um the coconut you can either use the, tin, the coconut in the tin or the regular coconut and I just get one from the store and I'm gonna use it because I really like the one in the I really like the coconut itself and we got some pumpkin and um black pepper rice the corned beef and uh, some mixed vegetable a margarine garlic and some white onion and I'm gonna have some green bell pepper. All right, guys. I go ahead and right, I, I go ahead and I blend the coconut. Blend the coconut and, and I shred, shred the, the pumpkin. pumpkin. And I'm gonna just pour so it inside. So I'm gonna just go right to and now. Let it cook a little. I like the pumpkin. The pumpkin shred when I'm making the pumpkin rice. Coconut milk. It much. Okay. It, to, to me, it's much more. I'm gonna just make get it, um, the rice more a tablespoon. And I'm gonna add some butter, butter, butter margarine, some margarine inside, pour inside, and I'm just gonna just give make it this boil. Stir. So the coconut milk. I'm can gonna cook. go right ahead and get a uh, two some salt. I'm gonna add some salt, tablespoon of salt or salt like to your two taste. Two teaspoon of salt, and you can add the salt to your taste. Just pour it out inside. All right, so it's gonna just give it a stir. stir. And I do it and this I'm way. Just so gonna get right into the can corn beef. Um, catch the Quick color. Simple corn beef. So I'm gonna make it some mixed vegetable color at the finish. So I'm just and gonna to give you a sneak peek of that. All right, I'm gonna get some time. All right, here I'm gonna, have I'm just gonna add a piece just of put some thyme. thyme inside. And you can add scallion also so if you like. Star. Alright, I'm just gonna leave it for it can boil for ten to fifteen minutes. And the thing is um the coconut milk, the coconut milk need to cook properly, so you're gonna give it at least roughly ten fifteen minutes so the coconut milk can cook properly. Alright guys. Alright then while the rice right, is let's get right into over the here beef. steaming. Um, there it is. It's and gonna the coconut milk is gonna over boil here. I just wanna show you. I'm gonna go right to Adam um, prepare the It's gonna do the corned corn beef. beef. I'm gonna, gonna add some it's gonna drop the garlic. Let's drop some put the garlic in, garlic the, pot. in the pot. I get some the corned beef with the mixed vegetables. Onions. Some onions. And some Alright, some Red, some sorry, red green pepper. bell pepper. I'm just gonna give this guys, a thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and share. And I hope you're enjoying my dishes that I'm preparing. I'm just gonna give this a stir. The aroma of the onion and the garlic is oh, so well, the so onion nice. and the garlic and the sweet pepper is steaming down. I'm gonna just um, get the mixed vegetable. Add the mixed vegetable onion. now inside. Throw inside. Put it inside. Put the mixed vegetable. I'm just gonna give it All a right. quick stir. Just gonna give it a quick stir again. And the corned beef is. A little salty, so you want to be careful how you put salt in the corned beef. All right. So what I'm gonna do now? I'm gonna add some some black pepper to this. And let it steam a little. All right. Here we go. I'm just gonna add I'm a little, little black, black pepper. pepper. Not this too one. much. And you can add to your taste. You don't want to put too much. Um, and the corned beef has salt in, inside, so you don't want to add um, 
that much salt because it comes with is salty. And that is the thing when you add the when salt and after the rice, it, see? it is too salty. Can start to boil. You, can have, to you have to be careful with the um, look at the. You have to be careful with the coconut milk. The rice because it don't sit one place. Come in the coconut milk. Back to this. Let's give it a little some more stir. Alright, you want to turn on the stove. You want to let's turn on the stove. Turn little. it down on low. Not too high, just we'll low. Turn that can steam. The vegetable can steam. Steam for like two minutes, two to three minutes. Alright, here's the corned beef. Right, I'm opening the corned beef. Now there's a and what you want to do? You want to put the corned beef in something separate I just don't so you can get the beef from the pot. Little little from better. the pen to the All pot. Right. And this I is what you're running from. Because you the can, fatty you can from see, the there's a lot of fat inside I'm the corned beef. I'm just going to use so. a knife. And as you can see at the side. And go around and at the clean up the fat. I'm going to take out the fat. That and I'm going to look all around you don't want to inside. see that that is too much fat, fat is there so I can take off. Inside the beef already has enough fat, fat so you don't beef. want that excess so fat. So you're just going to go right around. Inside. Right, so you don't see not too much. You're just going to take out this piece. And there it is. Right, there you are. And I'm just going to... Sure, some of it is in right. the thing, so it's good that there's then a lot gonna of use a spoon. not a lot come Same on spoon the, in the pot. I'm gonna, gonna go ahead and break it, break it up here, and then I add it in the pot like this. And I don't do my corned beef wet, so I don't put a lot of like a lot of. You're still gonna I don't do put it in water. The, in, inside the. I just put a lot. Pot, a but you just wanna give you an a little more. A little ketchup leeway so you can manage it a little better in the pot. I don't like when the corn right, beef is more just like watery. So I don't put it here. So all of it here. Yeah. A lot of pe people do it different but it this is how I like it. I don't really like to add water. Some people add water. I don't add water to it. Guys, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share. Leave a comment. All right, and I right, go ahead and I put a little some ketchup inside. I'm sorry, I add the just gonna ketchup give it and it, it finished. Stir in the ketchup and then stir in the ketchup inside. It. And then and it's we have a beautiful corned beef mixed vegetable. Mixed vegetable. And I like my corned beef. Corn beef not dry. And as not you can too see, dry, it's so beautiful. Not too wet. So beautiful. You can add this with some bread, or you can add it with some plain rice. You can. All right, and this is it. Have it with some pasta. This is our corned beef. But today I'm gonna have it with some rice, Mix it up some up. coconut, right, look pumpkin at it. rice, or some pumpkin coconut so rice. So amazing. And there it go. So wonderful, gorgeous. Alright, let's get back to the rice. Alright, here's the rice. I'm gonna right, here we go. um, just to wash the rice, the rice inside. thoroughly. You wanna um, wash wash the rice thoroughly? Add it to the, to the pot. Okay. And the thing with rice that I do as I put it on the fire, I make it boil. Wash and then I cover it. Star. And add it steam. I put it on an extra low. So it's beautiful. Extra low fire so it take its golden take yellow it time and steam golden yellow the coconut is oil it is the coconut you see the coconut, coconut bring up a lot, a lot of oil of inside oil on the top and i'm not going to take off the oil off the top i'm just going to leave it so that's why i'm going to put and then i'm going to i'm going to close it now so it take its it time and, and let it rise steam and down steam and not i fire right. speed well right, quickly guys, there is it all right um, here we have just need to steam on a little more. Just give it the rice. Um, this as I said before, you have to be careful. Almost with finished the product because the coconut it has. And see the beauty of it. The it's the first time I'm looking at it. And what, what's good is when it's good is when it's the pumpkin nice and rice. Shelly. And when you just shred the pumpkin, more. this is what happened. Most of the pumpkin is going to be on the top, so you want to go in and give it a stir and mm. put the pumpkin all over in, in it just look at this it's so beautiful all right guys oh, this right. is the pumpkin finished product rice. of the rice the pumpkin coconut nice pumpkin rice wish you can hear and guys thanks for so thanks again for watching
please like comment and share so wonderful and it is so gorgeous i wish you would be here can so you can smell the aroma of this it's so golden it's okay this is a finished right product dish it out This is the finished product.